Even older Australian Shepherds can sometimes frustrate their owners if they have issues with potty training or destructive chewing. Crate training your rambunctious Australian Shepherd can help you gain peace of mind and keep your dog safe all at the same time. However, kennel training is a process that you will want to take your time with to ensure its long-term success. If you are ready to tackle crate training your Australian Shepherd, here are six easy steps you need to get started. How to crate train your Australian Shepherd. Are you worried that your Australian Shepherd is going to hate his crate? This is an initial reaction many pet owners have when they first start the process. The good news is that many dogs come to love having their own space in your home where they can retreat. It does take patience and you should move slowly through these steps to ensure that this is a positive training experience for your pup or older dog. Here is everything you need to know to get started. Choose the right size crate for your Australian Shepherd. The first key to success is to purchase a crate that will be the appropriate size for your Australian Shepherd. How do you know what size is the best fit? It should be big enough for them to stand up and turn around. If the crate is too big, it gives them tacit permission to potty in a far corner of the space without having to deal with the mess. If you currently have an Australian Shepherd puppy, purchase a crate that will be the right size for their full adult size. Introduce your Australian Shepherd to the crate slowly. This is a key step towards crate training your dog. You never want to move too quickly as it can feel forced and ruin the experience for your Australian Shepherd. Place the crate in a room where you spend a lot of time such as your family room or home office. This gives your dog some time to get used to the idea of seeing it there, and he may even begin to investigate the crate all on his own. If he doesn't, you can begin to introduce the crate slowly. Walk over to the crate and speak in happy tones to your Aussie puppy. Drop a few yummy treats near the door of the crate to get your dog interested in walking over with you. Once this is successful, move the treats to just inside the door of the crate where your Australian Shepherd will have to put his head in to retrieve them. Eventually, you will progress to tossing treats all the way in the back of the kennel. For dogs who are not food motivated, you might try placing a favorite toy in the crate. Make it comfortable for your Australian Shepherd. This is also a great time to make sure your dog is going to be comfortable in the crate. If your dog is already housebroken, you might be able to add a dog bed or a towel to the bottom of the kennel. However, you should avoid doing this if your dog is likely to tear it apart or use the bathroom on it. Don't feel bad if your Australian Shepherd cannot safely have anything comfortable in their crate just yet. It may be something you can introduce later down the line. Start kenneling your Australian Shepherd with rewards. Now it's time to officially start kennel training your dog. Call your dog over to the crate, issue a command, and encourage them to enter with your hands. Never force them to enter the crate. If you need to, use food to lure them into the crate. Once they are safely in the crate, give them the food reward and shut the door gently. Stay where your Australian Shepherd can see you while they are in the crate for these first few attempts. Sit quietly next to them for five to 10 minutes before letting them out. After you practice this way a few times, you can start to leave the room. Keep the sessions extremely short and practice them several times throughout the day. Work up to longer increments in the crate until you can leave them there comfortably for about 30 minutes. Extend the time in the crate. Once your Australian Shepherd is comfortable staying in his crate for 30 minutes while you are home, you can start to leave them there while you are gone. Because they will be in the crate for longer periods of time, this is a great time to start associating positive things with their crate. Instead of giving them a treat after entering, slip them a favorite toy. Many dogs like a Kong ball that has been stuffed with peanut butter or cream cheese. You can even put it in the freezer overnight so that the food will last longer for them. This takes your dog's mind off of being in the kennel and gives them something to look forward to when you leave. Remember that your Australian Shepherd still is not used to being in the crate all day. 
they need to be relieved every few hours with a bit of exercise or at the very least a bathroom break. If you are crate training a puppy, they cannot hold their bladder for more than three to four hours. Set your dog up for success by planning frequent bathroom breaks. Sleeping in the crate. If your goal is to have your Australian Shepherd sleep in the crate, you are now ready to tackle this. Keep the crate close to you during sleeping hours. Ideally, it would be in the bedroom with you. This allows you to hear if your Aussie puppy needs a bathroom break in the early morning hours. For adult dogs who are just being crate trained, it means that they won't feel so isolated and anxious while they sleep. Give your Australian Shepherd the same command you always use to ask him to enter the crate. Follow it up with a treat as usual. Initially, your dog may do some whining at night. This can be quite annoying while you are trying to get some solid shut-eye, but do your best to ignore it. If your Australian Shepherd has already been out to go to the bathroom, they are likely just crying for attention. Don't reward their whining with any type of attention, positive or negative. How to Crate Train an Australian Shepherd Puppy for Potty Training You can use all of the same tips above to implement crate training for housebreaking. Just remember that a young puppy will have a difficult time holding it for long periods of time. You should make arrangements to take them out at frequent and regular intervals to give them an opportunity to use the bathroom. Whenever they do use the restroom outside, it is best to make a big deal of rewarding them for this excellent behavior. Now you might be wondering, how long does it take to crate train my dog? There is no easy answer for how long it can take to crate train an Australian Shepherd. Some Aussies love their crate and training may only take days. If your puppy is more resistant, it may be a matter of weeks. At the end of the day, crate training your Australian Shepherd is an important component of being a pet owner. It ensures that your dog stays out of trouble while you are away and it prevents them from using the bathroom in the house when unattended. Make sure to move slowly through these steps to give your pup time to get used to the new routine.